The following is a partial products method for multiplication. Although partial products is very different from the traditional method, this method helps students understand how multiplication works. Step one, estimate. Like any algorithm, you should first make a ballpark estimate so you can check your final answer to see if your answer is plausible. To begin with, we will round 26 to 30, keeping the five, multiplying them together for our estimate of 150. Step two, break Think apart. of 26 as 20 plus six. Step three, multiply each part. Multiply each part of 26 by five. To begin with, 20 times five equals 100. Six times five equals 30. Step four, line up products. Be certain to line your products up according to place value. Step five, add the product. 100 plus 30 equals a final answer of 130. Step six, check the final answer. Redo the problem. If in our final answer of 130, we want to compare it against the ballpark estimate of 150. Our final answer of 130 seems within reason of our ballpark estimate. It appears as though we are done. Step one, estimate. Step two, break apart. Step three, multiply each part. 20 times 30. Twenty times four. Thirty times six. Six times four. Step four, line up the products. Step five, add the products. Step six, check the final answer. Redo if needed. 